to what I forget for myself, Retton, Robert and uh, Jan from the Life Control Center. We are really, really appreciating your time to be with us here on Wadaf. It's a really wonderful afternoon, of course. Yes, we have ended early in the morning. We were working about the car. Everything's running perfect at the stage. Really for sure, we're going to head on, trying to check around where the, I mean, the pride of land where early in the morning the big ones are headed. Just getting here, and the female, as you can see here, lying on the shadow. It's quite a number of family of mine, also the youngster around in the area, which is more, more on the right of the dominant male lions, really for sure. It's one of the interesting sightings, seeing all the youngster. It might be because when they get uh, found by the other male lions that might be enter into area, all of them they might get killed. So really for sure, female have to separate them. Then as a result, some of them they have to survive, and some of them if they really get killed with the other male or from hyena, even from buffalo, sometimes it may happen. Even elephant, really for sure. The chance of the youngster in the area is too slim to survive. Reason behind that, the biggest threat is another lion that might be entered into area. Believe me, it could be female or male. If you get to come across with the cub that doesn't belong to her or him, you're really going to kill it. is because they really want to reduce the competition of future because the female might get challenged in future or a male might get challenged in future so you will really kill the youngster if it's a female will kill the youngster for competitive reducing competition of the future as i said if it's a male, also is going to do it here on the prize of lions. The pride it consists with aunts and sisters that are all related. Like we have spotted cubs here, we have seen cubs here. Really, if cubs are belongs to this pride here, if they're big enough, what they're going to happen, especially young males, they're withdrawn from the pride. And it would be to live, and and that they're going to fight with the other males and challenge a fight, and push them off, and start to operate with the female. It's really for sure. Lions are a lot more sensitive on inbreeding; they don't do that at all. There might be the same uh, pride come back, but really, they won't be not the one. They won't be interested on mate. They will never ever do that. They have to go somewhere and mate with the other pride and produce their own gene. because of the shadow where the, the young calves are as you can see it's very easy for them to blend in, in in any color form of this season as grass are more yellow and the end yellow which in color which is very easy for the calves to hide anywhere remember all these cats are black and white in color 
they're seeing black and white. Really, the cops were the hiding. If the point of view is black and white, you'll be struggling to see there what's going on. Or termite, tall grass. It will be a lot more difficult to see. Speak young, young, I mean, young comes stepping forward, coming towards a dominant male and a female. You just want to see what's going to happen, yeah? It could be the mother of the young girl, yeah? Or it might be the youngster getting inquisitive on finding out what's going on in the vehicle. Really, it will be a very lovely young male if you start to do that coming close to your vehicle to understand the business of wild F, what we're doing here. Really, it's in our blood to, to see the animal around. Getting close and close is what we actually expecting for the young males or for the young cubs to do. Coming here is a lot more one of the things that really will follow this pride is to make sure the youngsters are getting used to vehicle. After being eating buffalo, I've seen the male and the female, it's still going to take at least four days to complete whatever they have in the stomach to digest completely. After that, really, another three days they will be moving around in the area. They might have the cups here, that would be a very good thing. That guarantee we have a lion every day around in the area of operation. Let's take our time and check what the youngster are up to. Don't forget it's very windy here. It might be very difficult to hear my voice or anything that may happen happening around the lions. As you can see, grass are moving. It's disturbing quite a lot here. Charles coming. Uh, I copy you that you Mawari. Uh, the Zungala are still on the eastern side of uh, the drainage line where you guys spotted there. A little bit dodgy sighting, uh, but we are here. Uh, to get here, you have to drive from the eastern side of the drainage line and that old track. Now we are sitting with one more father and one male, and we can see young star from the nice distance. Thank you. You just let the other station know that the Ngala is uh, on the eastern side. Talking to one of our guide 